Um, hello, uh, my name is John Rostakis. I am one of the founders of uh, the Synergia Institute and one of the developers and facilitators uh, for this course, uh, Transition to Cooperative Commonwealth. I would like to welcome all of you for taking part in this. Uh, hope you find it stimulating and, and interesting. Um, uh, but most of all, um, inspiring and practically useful for the work that you are involved in and that you wish to do. Um, I just want to say a few things about uh, the background uh, to this uh, online course, uh, sort of set the context for it, um, and then uh, talk a little bit about the content of this uh, first uh, introductory module for, uh, for the course. Uh, Synergia is an international network of uh, academics, uh, practitioners, uh, activists, uh, thinkers, um, uh, and uh, organizers who have been uh, directly involved in system change uh, work uh, for most of their lives. Uh, and it's a quite an extensive network involving a number of universities, uh, social justice organizations, uh, NGOs, uh, and so on. Uh, Synergy I came together uh, about four years ago uh, when I and a group of uh, my friends and colleagues uh, started thinking about uh, the uh, crucial necessity for gathering together um, some of the uh, best streams in our view um, of both uh, ideas, uh, theory and action uh, that need to converge and come together to construct uh, a new vision uh, for a new kind of political economy uh, to offer a constructive alternative to uh, this uh, late stage of uh, extremely destructive uh, capitalism uh, that we are all now uh, dealing with. Uh, this was, as I said, about four years ago when things were already very grim, uh, especially in the years following uh, the financial crisis uh, and the meltdown of the international uh, financial system uh, in 2008, uh, the upsurge in uh, public and civil resistance uh, and critique of the uh, international, uh, the global financial system but also more uh, broadly, uh, the ways in which uh, capitalism, in particular this neoliberal uh, form of late stage capitalism um, has evolved into an extraordinarily uh, destructive uh, force uh, for uh, politics, uh, for societies and communities, and uh, very much uh, for the uh, environmental uh, degradations uh, and catastrophes we are now seeing increasing uh, day by day. So the impetus for Synergia was to bring together and to converge a number of uh, key uh, movements uh, for system change. This included the cooperative movement, um, the emerging commons movement, and of course the movement for sustainability and uh, environmental uh, stewardship and protection. So the outlines for this kind of an online course uh, emerged uh, a couple of years ago uh, with the decision to provide uh, people that had uh, commitment and an interest in system change and in constructing um, a clear alternative to the, uh, the capitalist paradigm that we are in um, to offer some ideas, theory, practice, models, um, and concrete examples of what uh, a new political economy might look like. Uh, what is the vision that drives uh, a new view of uh, political economy? And what are the kinds of actions, practically speaking, that uh, people and communities can take to construct uh, a political economy that puts uh, planet and people before profits? Uh, for us, this was uh, a common thread, uh, this idea of um, preserving and protecting 
uh, our natural environment, the health and well-being of our planet, and the well-being of individuals and their communities as a fundamental focus and purpose of uh, a political economy. So what does this actually look like? Um, we have uh, proposed in this course uh, the idea of cooperative commonwealth as being a general framework for how we envision a new form of a progressive, uh, socially and environmentally responsible political economy. What cooperative commonwealth means, um, what its principles are, how it's constructed, and how it's applied uh, in strategic parts or sectors uh, of our economies is really the content uh, of this course. So uh, you will be uh, uh, joining us in exploring both the history uh, and the practice of cooperative commonwealth. Uh, what does it mean in terms of fundamental principles? What does it mean in terms of political analysis and economic analysis? And finally, what it means in terms of day-to-day -day practice. We hope that what you learn uh, and what you share with others uh, in this course will be of immediate uh, uh, practical value to you and your community and the work that you do, uh, but also a stimulus, uh, a focusing point and a round table for sharing your experiences, your insights, uh, your reactions to the ideas and the materials in this course and sharing those ideas, sharing that feedback uh, with the people that you work with and with others that are also taking part uh, in this online uh, learning uh, process. So welcome. Uh, we look forward to your participation in this. We look forward to your feedback. Um, and we'll be checking in with you over the course of the modules uh, to see how you're doing and to hear from you uh, directly. Thank you, and uh, we hope you enjoy this. <laughs>